Good morning everyone, it's Fiona from the um, Facebook Angelic Inspiration page. Um, the card for today is Open Your Mind. Yes, new ideas and opportunities that present themselves to you can be scary, but they can also be very exciting. If you're being shown a new path, trust that your angels are taking you there for your own highest good. So unless the changes you are being offered are not fitting in some way with your natural sense of integrity, take the road to new newness. You never know where it may lead unless you try. Um, that was taken from Mary Jack's A Pocket Full of Angels card deck. So the theme on the page has been change. I've been going on about that since we hit 5,000 and um, I, for me, I feel that's very true. Lots of things are changing, lots of things are shifting, people are being different, um, I'm being different. Um, but that can also bring anxiety and stress because um, things aren't as they were and the new dynamics might be quite daunting or you're questioning them. Um, try not to and just try and shake it off or breathe it out. Um, find a way to relax and release so maybe an hour in the gym or um, five minutes of dancing to your favorite songs or even just going to the woods and screaming um, or find a couple of moments in nature to relax and unwind and i've also taken um, a card from oracle cards by annie b which were free in the spirit and soul magazine um, out here in the uk and the card is from the heart three Gratitude is the fairest blossom that springs from the soul, so thankfulness, being thankful, thankful to yourself for allowing the changes, thankful to others for helping you with the changes, and thank you also to the angels and the divine, whoever it is that you believe in. I'm not, you know, dictating that anybody has to believe in what my page represents, but I think you can change any of what is said on the page to whatever it is that you believe in or whoever it is that you believe in because um, that's the beauty of a lot of the beliefs are that they actually are quite similar to each other um, they just have different names and if more people would accept that then more people would be happy um, so embrace the changes unless they really really don't resonate with you um, but I can't really see why I think a lot of it is fear fear of the unknown fear of how will that affect the rest of my life? Well, changes always bring, often bring a, uh, endings with them. So just be thankful, as the heart card says, and um, maybe if you need some healing around this time, ask Archangel Raphael to come in and heal you um, or offer you some healing. Um, ask Archangel Shamuel to come in and spray some love sprinkles around you um, and be kind to yourself that's the most important thing is being kind to yourself um, the road ahead can be good if you let it be if you don't want it to be good then it can't be good because you're just bringing that in with your thoughts so just let it happen and ask the angels for signs I had yesterday a couple of signs that were quite um, funny because um, I asked for a sign to make a choice and I got the first sign and I didn't really acknowledge it. I just thought, wow, why is that woman pushing that huge thing past me? And then um, later I saw this um, dead bird in the road and I thought, what kind of a sign is that? And then I got led back to the sign that had just walked past me and I was like, oh, that's a sign. And then I was really happy because I got the sign that I, I, I was looking for. And then I went into a, a charity shop and... Um, I was trying to get an outfit for something and then I was like, oh, oh no, there's a sign to go with the other thing. So which one is it? So <laughs> I still don't know. I have to see both, I suppose. Sometimes you've got to live through both um, things if you have a choice and then make a choice on your experience that feels right to you. You can't just make a choice without um, living through certain things. So going with the flow and all that. Anyway, um, ramble, ramble. I hope you have a wonderful Sunday. Goodbye.